Okay. Sunrise, May 2nd, 2015. The family that prays together stays together. We are on top of... You don't even know. Chirahela Skyway. I know that. <laughs> Penny, you are first. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament shows his handiwork. Day unto day utters speech, and night unto night reveals knowledge. There is no speech nor language where their voice is not heard. Their line has gone out through all the earth, and their words to the end of the world. In them he has set a tabernacle for the sun, which is like a bridegroom coming out of his chamber, and rejoices like a strong man to run its race. Its rising is from one end of heaven, and its circuit to the other end, and there is nothing hidden from its heat. The law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise the simple. The statutes of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, enlightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than gold, yea, than much fine gold, sweeter also than honey and the honeycomb. Moreover by them your servant is warned, and in keeping them there is great reward. Who can understand his errors? Cleanse me from secret faults. Keep back your servant also from presumptuous sins. Let them not have dominion over me. Then I shall be blameless, and I shall be innocent of great transgression. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight, O Lord, my strength and my Redeemer. Psalms 19, 1 through 14. Thank you. Jacob? Do you want me to read all this in the yes. three? Yes, everything. Okay. You're good. All right. I have a speech impediment. So. For this reason, I bow my knees to the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ from whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named, that he would grant you, according to the riches of his glory, to be strengthened with the might through his Spirit in the inner man, that Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith, that you, being rooted to the ground in love, may be able to comprehend with all of the saints what is the width and length and depth and height, to know the love of Christ, which passes knowledge, that you may be filled with all the fullness of God. Now to him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us. To him be glory in the church by Christ Jesus, to all generations forever and ever. Amen. Ephesians 3, 14-21 this is oh. my command. Hold on, Jacob's got... Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. we're not my, done. My, my, my beef. On. I'm sorry. I love okay. those who love me, and those who seek me diligently will find me. My fruit is better than gold, yes, fine, yes, than fine gold, and my revenue than choice silver, that I may cause those who love me to inherit wealth, that I may fill their, tre their treasures. Proverbs 8.21 all right, Allie, you're up. This is my c commandment, that you love one another as I ha have loved you. John 15, 12. Thank you. Will? Love suffers long, it is kind. Love does not envy, love does not parade itself, is not puffed up, does not believe does not behave rudely, it does not seek its own, it is not provoked, thinks no evil, does not rejoice in iniquity, but rejoices in the truth, bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails, but whether there are prophecies, they will fail. Whether they are tongues, they will cease. Whether there is knowledge, it will vanish away. And now abide faith, hope, love, these three, but the greatest of these is love. 1 Corinthians 13, 4 through 8, and 13. Okay, Will, will you come Ooh. videotape? Ow, ow! Okay. <laughs> Abby, All you're right. up. Wait. Wait. <coughs> Abby, you are up. Okay. Sorry for the shaking. Who can find a virtuous wife, for her worth is far above rubies? 
The heart of her husband safely trusts her, so he will have no lack of gain. She does him good and not evil all the days of her life. Proverbs 31, 10 through 12. Strength and honor are her clothing. She shall rejoice in time to come. Proverbs 31, 25. Charm is deceitful and beauty is passing, but a woman who fears the Lord, she shall be praised. Proverbs 31, 30. Her children rise up and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praises her. Proverbs 31, 28. Houses, houses and riches are inheritance from fathers, but a prudent wife is from the Lord. Proverbs 19, 14. Husbands, love your wives just as Christ also loved the church and gave himself for her, that he might sanctify and cleanse her with the washing of water by the word, that he might present her to himself a glorious church not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing but that should be holy and without blemish so husbands out ought to love their own wives as their own bodies he who loves his wife loves himself ephesians 5 25 through 21 good job little princess husband's wife Husbands, likewise, dwell with them with understanding, giving honor to the wife as the weaker vessel and as being heirs um, together of the grace of Christ, that your prayers may not be hindered. First Peter 3, 7 and, oh, three, seven. An excellent wife is the crown of her husband. Proverbs 12, 4. Thank you all very much. Mm -hmm. Penny, my dearest dear. I'm so thankful for you. Thankful that God brought you into my life. Into my life with my children. Then he has brought me into your life with the daughters. Um, God has blessed me greatly through this. I'm thankful for the, the great times, the hard times. I'm thankful for it all. I want God to continue to bless us. I want us to experience the rest of our life together. Penny, I promise to be your protector, to stand between you and anybody, against the enemy, against all things. I want to be your provider, to provide for you financially, provide for you as a husband should be, provide in all ways. I want to be the priest. I want to be the priest of this family to pray deeply for our family. I promise to pray for you and this family the rest of my life. I also want to be the prophet. I want to prophesy over our family. I want to speak life into it, speak life unto you. I want to watch out for the car that is coming, <laughs> getting ready to run Will over as he's in the street. But that's okay. That's part of us. I love us and I love our life. Surely as the sun comes up on the horizon, I promise that I will love you and keep you the rest of my life. I will never desert you. If I hurt you, I promise to ask for forgiveness. I promise to always love you. Penny. Will you do to me the honor of becoming my wife? Yes. I yes, yes. <laughs> yes. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I gotta do I gotta do my thing. As the sun's coming up, let me do my oh, yeah, you ain't letting go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He has to let go. The ring has to go I love on. you, Penny. Hold on. You gotta look. Okay. I'm gonna take this ring off. Okay. I'm gonna put this ring on your finger. I prom promise to love, honor, and cherish you the rest of my life. I love you, Penny. And I promise we'll put that ring back on.
Because we promise, we've made a commitment to be pure until marriage. And that vow will never be broken until wedding night. I love you. Uh, <laughs> sorry, kids. Sorry. I had to. Sleep over it, Will. I love our family. Okay. All right. We can stop this. Uh, Will, let's get the selfie stick. All right. Selfie stick time. Selfie stick. Woo.